Yo, this is your boy Zamba Nietzsche by X and I'm back with another video. So guys, uh, I'm walking right here in 15 miles. You can see. Okay. I'm in the village. Now, this village is getting it's getting an upgrade. Because right in front, or right in the middle of the village, we have a dual carriageway being created. Okay. This is a very, very good thing. It means that the time that it's gonna be taking for us to move from this village into the central business district of Osaka gonna be a hell of a lot shorter look at this challenge this is one of the challenges of uh, building a new road because they're gonna have to dismantle this pole this electric pole you see they're gonna have to break it up in order for the road to pass through you see what i mean yeah as you can see there's a lot of progress a lot of progress is being made i mean just check off over there okay guys so now uh the main thing that i'm even talking to you right now is that I want to tell you the reasons why I failed to get monetized on YouTube. Okay, as you know, when you reach uh, 1,000 subscribers and uh, and uh, this 4,000 watch hours, yeah, you start getting paid. But how come I failed to reach that? I felt you start getting paid. Now, I want to tell you something that a lot of us YouTubers do. The greatest mistake that YouTubers do, the greatest number one mistake that YouTubers do, is that they believe they can just upload a video and it goes viral. Nine. Ah, that's great, man. Ah. Ah, that's a rock driver, man. That's rock driving. He sees that there are people passing. And he's just stepping on the gas, man. And double boosting his vehicle like that, you know. Ah, that's crazy. So, yo, let me continue. You see, guys, we don't own... Well, let me not say we don't own. It's far easier to get your videos be recognized by the YouTube search engine if you try and copy something from the titles of the videos which are already popular it makes searching a whole lot easier okay that's the number one thing the number two thing because I didn't know that you know now I know the number two thing why I first get monetized is that I didn't know how to read the YouTube metrics. You see what I mean? The first metric that you should read, the first one, is you got to go to the analytics in the dashboard, okay? And view how your videos are doing over a period of seven days. Then do your mathematics. If you're getting, for example, 40 watch hours in seven days then you're doing very well if you're getting 15 watch hours every seven days that's also well because 15 times 4 it is it is how much <laughs> it's 60 okay 60 times 10 
No, wait. That's not okay. Because 60 times 10 gives you 600. No. That ain't okay, guys. If you if you if your watch I was are showing you that you're getting 15 in seven days, then you're you're on you're you're on the way down. You're not doing well. You see what I mean? Every seven days you should be getting at least at the very minimum. Get a hundred. What is this? Oh, those are technical stuff, you know, technical stuff about uh, road building, you know. So I guess I've got to move to the other side of the road now. They are doing their technical stuff, okay. So like I said, you have to be getting at least every month, get 400 watch hours. If you're getting 400 watch hours every month, then in 10 months, you're going to have 4,000 watch hours. With your 1,000 subscribers, you are sure to get monetized. So you have to keep that metric in check. The monthly metric has got to be 4,000, 400, I mean, every month. Meaning, the weekly metric has got to be at least, at least 100. Every week, just try, at least 100. You see what I mean? If every week you show, your metric is showing you at least 100 watch hours, then you're okay. Now, if you're gonna get 100 watch hours every week, it means that every day, you should be doing at least 15. 15 watch hours every day, you know what I'm saying? Because if you're doing 15 watch hours every day, it means that if you multiply that by seven, you will be somewhere at at what? <laughs> 105? Yeah. You'd be up at 105, which is okay. You know what I mean? If you're at 105, that's okay because it means that when the man finishes, you're going to be at 400. You see what I mean? So, man, there's dust here, man. Oh, don't know how I'm going to move, man. Huh? That. So guys, that's what I'm saying. So if you have, for example, 15 watch hours every day, then you're okay. Check that metric. You know what I'm saying? Go in your analytics and check the metric, the daily metric. If it's saying that you are getting 15 watch hours every day, then you're doing okay. Okay? Or bell. 15 watch hours or bell. See what I mean? If you're getting. It's too much dust. If you're getting less than 15 watch hours every day, then you're not doing okay. You see what I mean? means that your channel is not going to be monetized and that's the problem that I had that's how come I thought to get monetized despite reaching 1000 watch hours you know what I mean? so now my strategy is that every day I watch that metric what is the metric telling me if it tells me that yesterday I had 10 watch hours then I know I'm not doing well so I pull up my socks before it gets crazy. You see what I mean? You have to read that metric. That's the most important metric that every YouTuber must read. Okay? The daily watch hours. Because that, when you do your math, is going to tell you where you're going. You see what I mean? It's going to tell you where you're going. Okay, look at that.
Fu. Ah. Hmm. Yo, I had no idea this is how roads are built, man. I had no idea. So cement, that's how they put it on the road. Wow. This is something new I've learned today, man. Did you know? Look. I can say I have witnessed a road being built like step by step when you follow my videos I've documented the stages which they've been going through okay now this is awesome this is awesome you see that Yo, that's a road being built, man. In fact, a motorway being built. You see what I mean? So guys, like I said, the two metrics that you should watch out is one, how many watch hours are you getting per day? If you can make sure that you are at 15 or better every day, then you're doing fine. And then per week, you have to be at 400 or better. Then you're okay. You see what I mean? I thought to meet those requirements and I didn't know that you have to monitor those metrics. There is no one on YouTube has ever mentioned that for you to get monetized, to be sure that you're going to be monetized in so, so many days and you have to watch those metrics. No one has ever said that to me. I just discovered it myself that look, it does not make sense for me to be looking at the yearly watch hours i should be looking at the daily watch hours because that is what's going to tell me whether i'm on the right track or not okay yo so hit me with a comment tell me what you think down below okay Share Benzi for me, shouldn't you? I'm commenter. It's really busy. Yeah? <laughs> this is a good mention. And thank you for your understanding. Thank you for your understanding. I'm saying that I love you guys. Okay? So, thank you for, for your support. I love that. Okay? And, uh, guys, until next time, okay? I'm out of here. Till next time. Peace.